This is a rather nice um, buoyancy demonstration that you can do at home. It's just an ordinary plastic bottle. And inside here you can see it's one of those little eyedroppers, like, look like little fish. And round the end of it I've wrapped a plastic paperweight. I filled it up with water and adjusted the buoyancy of the little plastic fish so that when I squeeze the bottle, the little plastic fish drops. And when I don't squeeze it, it goes up. So what are we doing here? Why is it dropping down? We're not changing the density of the water this time. What we're doing is we're changing the density of the little bead that's going up and down, the little fish that's going up and down. So there's a hole in the bottom, and as I squeeze the water bottle, it squeezes a little bit of extra water in, which increases the density of the bead in here. And that means that its density is greater than the average density of the water. So its weight force is greater than the buoyant force, and it drops down. When I release the pressure, its density decreases and it rises up again. So there we go. One that you can make at home, buoyancy.